here in Phoenix, Arizona. How is everybody doing out there on Saturday? That's right. It is Saturday and it is, wow, it's 11.24 p.m. No, a.m. I mean, I'm sorry about that. 11.24 a.m. That is pretty crazy. I had a pretty long day today. A very busy day, actually. Not a very long morning or day. A very busy morning I had. Very busy morning. Did very, very well in the Valley of Phoenix today. Hopefully it's better tomorrow or the same tomorrow. I, won't, I can't complain if it's the same tomorrow. So hopefully it's the same tomorrow. But today I want to talk about managing your gas and maintenance expenses. Expenses. Managing your gas and maintenance expenses. Uh, the way I manage my gas, I pull it out every week. What I do is I start my, my week Monday through Sunday. I cash out Sunday when I'm done. Then I, I sort all the money out with bills, push my gas money aside for the week for the following week. That's how I manage my gas. Now, sometimes it don't work that great. And today is my gas day. So basically, I'm making gas for today uh, for the rest of the week. I will still, I, I did cash out today. Um, and I cashed out early today so that way I could go ahead and manage my money and my gas and st so on and so forth. So Sunday is going to start a new work a work week for me. For, so it'll be Sunday to Sunday uh, the following week. Uh, but that's how I manage my uh, gas. Uh, how I manage my expenses I have money put away for that. I do have money put away for that. Uh, I don't touch it. I don't mess with it. But I have money put away for tires, um, oil changes, battery, different types of maintenance on the vehicle. The good thing is I work on my vehicle myself. I don't let nobody touch my vehicle at all. I work on everything myself. So I save off the top. I don't have to pay uh, for for labor, I do all the labor myself, and I'm not a mechanic. No, sorry, I am not a mechanic. I use YouTube. You could build a house watching YouTube. Actually, you know what? You can actually become a lawyer <laughs> watching YouTube. So I YouTube it. It tells you everything down to the uh, very uh, uh, tool that you need. Um, so I YouTube it. I do everything online. Um, so it works out perfect, but that's how I, uh, I, uh, I cover my maintenance, uh, cost is I have money put aside for that, uh, just in case, as a matter of fact, I got to probably do a, a tune up on the vehicle coming up pretty soon. Uh, it's probably going to need some, uh, some filters, inside filter, outside filter, uh, probably spark plugs, uh, plugs and wires. Actually, the wires are pretty good, so I'll probably just do the spark plugs and do the air filter. Uh, probably check, test my battery, see how that good, how that's, uh, how uh, how much energy or or if it's still good. Because during the summer, your battery drains. Now we haven't really hit that hot summer. I mean, we have, but not extremely hot, hot. Um, so the battery is still good, but uh, other than that. Uh, I'm going to check, te have that te uh, tested out as well and uh, go from there and see if I need a battery because I always like to get be on top of my car uh, as far as maintenance go. Uh, but that's how it works out with gas and maintenance uh, expenses is that uh, I just stay on top of it. I pull my gas out for the week. I don't do it daily. I don't take out, you know, put gas daily out of my, my earnings. My earnings are from Monday to Sunday. That's it. If there's an emergency, I'll pull it out early. Now, I had to pull it out today due to didn't have it uh, the gas. So, uh, pulled it out, worked today, pulled it out, put my gas money aside, uh, paid a few bills, and then tomorrow I'll start new new work week. So, things will work out pretty good. Got to do a better better job on managing the gas, uh, gas expenses, but... Uh, <laughs> I do a pretty good job every week. It's sometimes I'll, I'll, I'll be a day uh, short, you know, a couple of days short. But other than that, it's pretty good uh, throughout the week, Monday through Sunday. I have the gas expenses put aside and uh, and I calculate that. So since the gas has been going down a little bit, I mean, it's good that I put, you know, so much money aside because I know how much I use per day. Um, 
And I calculate that. I mean, not at the exact penny, but I use anywhere from $20 to $30 a day. So I, I do put about $30 aside, $25 to $30 aside each day for gas. I calculate that for the end of the for the whole week, seven days. Um, like I said, for the for the maintenance, car maintenance, I have that money put aside. Uh, so that that's covered anytime I need a, a tire or a battery or anything like that I have it covered to put aside and I, I do all my work on my vehicle myself that's why it's got and believe it or not right now it does have 224,000 miles and five so 224 and five miles that's what it has right now um, and it runs good. It runs great. I mean, it's 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 due for an oil change. I'll be doing that shortly here soon. Uh, but other than that, it does run pretty good. Um, I just keep, you know, I check the fluids three times a week. Three to four times a week, I check the fluids on it. I check constantly to see if anything's leaking. I always check my tires constantly every day when I go out. And when I get home, I check the tires and uh, pull up, I, I pop the hood and check the engine, see if there's any leaks or any problems in the engine as well. So that's what I wanted to cover today is uh, gas and maintenance uh, cost, or you know, uh, you just got it. You just got to put. You got to do a good job on putting your money, you know, aside for those two things, and those two things are very important, uh, especially. Well, they're both important. You need gas, and you have to have that maintenance money aside just in case something happens, flat tire. Um, you know, anything can happen. I mean, you you, you can uh, get a flat tire. You know, you, uh, your car can, you know, break down due to, you know, a battery, you need a new battery, or, or whatever the case is. Uh, you just have to have that emergency money for your maintenance, for your car maintenance put aside. So other than that, today's Saturday, UNL driver here in Phoenix metropolitan area. And it's, uh, it's about 11.30 a.m. now. Had a very long morning. Started at 3 a.m., probably a little after 3 a.m. And uh, my, per my first passenger was uh, a woman, and she is a Lyft driver, but her car is in the shop. So she needed a ride to work. She does. She's employed. Plus, she does lift uh, part time after work. Uh, she does it. I, she said something about she goes out about three, four p.m. and and to like maybe eleven, uh, eleven ten, eleven o'clock at night. She says she does very well, uh, but she's uh, her car is down, so she's not working. So tough luck. Things happen. That's why I wanted to shoot this video. I do get a lot of passengers that their cars are down. So, you know, you just got to do a really good job on taking care of your car. Gas maintenance. I also did a video on any Uber, Lyft drivers, rideshare drivers, or anybody that needs a car. Go hit up Drive Now. Drive Now in Glendale. I did another video about that. Uh, you could look at my videos. And uh, I did a video. I called uh, one of the uh, the uh, representative, representatives there. Uh, and uh, he talked me through a little bit of how it works. He's in the finance department. Uh, so he doesn't know too much about, uh, um, about selling the car. I guess, you know, the sales department is probably a little bit different than the finance department. But he was a really cool dude. He has a lot of uh, five stars on the Google uh, review at Drive Now. Yeah, so... That's it. Just do a better job on uh, taking care of your vehicle. You know, uh, I like I said, I have that put aside for emergency, and I I do a pretty good job as far as gas uh, expenses for the week goes. Uh, I could do a better job, but I do an okay job uh, for gases for gas uh, expenses for the week. Um, other than that, that's right. It is that time. Oh yeah, that's right. Peace out.